tell a friend to tell a friend. Now do it all hollers in. And we're back with another NBA 2K24 next gen build video. And today I have a special Kevin Durant build for you guys that will be able to finish. You get contact dunks, great mid-range shooting, great three-point shooting. You can get your own shot and you can play defense. So make sure you watch the video to the end so I can show you guys how I created this masterpiece. Choose the hand of your choice in the jersey number your choice. Look, get it, man. But before I go any further, you already know what time it is. If you don't know, now you know. It's like button time, and I need you guys to go down there and hit that like button. Get this video to 100 likes. So for this build, we're going to power forward position. I know somebody's going to come in the comments and say Kevin Durant is 6'11". We know. But hey, man, we're going 6'10 with this build. 223 on the way, 16 wingspan. Let's get into the build. So we're going to start with the finishing. And I did want this build to have some finishing. So what I did was I took the driving dunk all the way up to an 87 and at an 87 you do get those contact dunks but you have to take the vertical up um you can take the vertical up to a 75 but we're going to take it up to an 80 because we want that shot blocking that um that i mean we want the the um chase down artist on goal and I, I'm, I'm losing my train of thought we want that chase down artist on goal so we're going to do that for the driver layup we're going to get that up to an 80 driving layup is really important this year man if, if you got it on your bill you will make a lot of layups, man. I'm talking about contested layups, 100% smother layups, all kind of layups, okay? And for the standard dunk, we're going to leave it right there. I would love to get that up, but we're going to leave it right there to 52 because that's what you get for taking the driving dunk up. For the post control, we're going to take that up to a 75 so we can't get that drop stepper, that post spin technician, and we also will be able to get um, the... Wait, hold on, hold on. Yeah, yeah, we get the we get the post fade phenom as well. I had to make sure. But for the finishing, this is really good, man. You do get fearless finishers as well. Let me take the strength up on this build because we do have some strength on it. Um, just in case you want to use that bulldozer badge, you can get it with this build. As you can see, we get posterizer silver. We get precision dunker. We get slithery. Area wizard. Bunny on gold. I like that badge. Two-step. I like that badge. Spin cycle. I like that badge. We got those on Hall of Fame. So you will be able to go out there and do some nice spin moves and some hop steps and, you know, all that stuff right there, man. I've been getting used to using the right analog. So I will be showcasing more of that stuff in the near future, all right? And for the close shot, uh, we don't get fast twitch. You need a 71 close shot or a 73 um, standard dunk. But to be honest, you probably don't be in the paint that much, you know, to where you have to use it. But, um, you know, when you get to the rim, you still can finish or whatever. But let's go ahead and get it to the green bean. Make your girl scream bad. And some people were complaining about the Kevin Durant bill saying it didn't have any mid-range shooting. So I listen, you know, but don't be disrespectful with it. You know what I'm saying? Like, I create bills a bunch of different ways. So some bills I may add mid-range, some bills I don't. But that don't mean it's not a Kevin Durant bill just because it don't have mid-range. You didn't say anything else about the other parts of the bill, but the mid-range is what stuck out to you. So, I mean, what stuck out to you. So, we're going to add some mid-range this time, man. You know what I'm saying? For all the people out there that be crying about that. You know what I'm saying? We got an 86 mid-range on the bill, man. You know what I'm saying? So, you can get in the mid-range, and then once they see the mid-range, they're going to complain about something else. But, hey, man, it is what it is. Three-point shot. We do have an 86, right? So, with 86 three-point shot, that does allow us to get limitless range where you get it on at 85. But the 86 does give us that, that um, Agent 3 on silver. But as you can see, the S tier badges are blinders, catch and shoot, corner specialist, dead eye, and limitless range. Those are the most important badges according to 2K. So everything else is really just icing on the cake, like I always say. You know what I'm saying? For the free throw, we do have that at a 70, so that's pretty good in my opinion. You can take it to a 71 to get free points if you want to, but it is what it is on that. So for the um, mid-range and the three-point shooting, you got all the badges that you need to be a great shooter with this build. As you can see, we will get that spot finder badge once we take the acceleration up. That's the only thing that's not highlighted. So we, let me go ahead and take that up while we're talking about it. So you can see that you do get that spot finder badge. Um, we get it on bronze, okay? And hold on. Oh, man, we, we could have got to a 68 acceleration. We could have got it on silver. Uh, ain't that something? I didn't pay attention to that, but uh, we had to do what we had to do to keep the rebounding. So that's why we got that um, acceleration like that. So we're, we're going to go ahead and get into the house. But before we do, I need you guys to do me a huge favor, right? Go down there, hit the like button, hit that subscribe button, hit that share button, and let the video play to the end because that will push the video to the recommended page so everybody mama can see the video. And I need everybody mama to see the video. So do that for your boy, boy. Now, for the ball handle on this build, we're going to take it to a 75. That's pretty good, in my opinion, to have a 75 ball handle on this build. Given the fact that you are 6 foot 10, you still can get your own shot, no doubt about it. Now, you can't get ankle breaker because you are too tall. 
Uh, we can't get speed boosted because you are too tall. So if you want, man, you can take this build down to six foot nine. So that'll uh, unlock some more badges for you guys, you know, and you can go out there and really, you know, take somebody's ankles. For the speed with ball, we're going to take that to a 69. As you can see, we do get big drive on Hall of Fame, very good badge. For the pass accuracy, we're going to get that up to a 75. You can take it up to a 77 if you want to. But for this build, we do have a 75, which is not that bad, okay? And as you can see, we do get, um, like I said, we get big driver. As you can see, we get physical handles on goal. We get blow by, killer combos, triple strike. We also get break starter, dimer, post playmaker, relay passer, touch passer, special delivery. That's a lot of badges that we can get access to, man, for real, for real. And I'm going to go back and count the amount of badges you have access to here in a minute, okay? But let's go ahead and get to the defense. Now, you do want defense on this build. You had the power forward position, so you don't want to be lacking, you know, but we don't have a lot of um, attribute upgrades left because we had to do what we had to do on the offense, right? So with the interior defense, we're gonna take that up to a 72. That does allow us to get some good interior defense. Not saying you're gonna be stopping centers and things of that nature, but you will give yourself a chance with that interior defense being at a 72. That can help you slow some people down in the paint. You will be able to get, well, no, you don't get post lockdown. Now, that's something that is a personal preference as well. If you wanna take that up to a 74 um, to get that post lockdown, um, we, we, let's let's revisit that. Hold on one second. We're going to take the perimeter defense up to a 71. That's for all the people out there that want the Challenger badge. Um, I know some people want that badge, but um, Challenger does pop up, man. But I get a lot of fouls called when I jump out there and try to block a shot. You know what I'm saying? So that's something they can fix, in my opinion. You know, like let me side, let me jump to the side and try to block the shot. You know what I'm saying? For the steal, we're going to take that to a 72. That's a personal preference. I took it to a 72 to get your glove, interceptor, and right stick ripper. For the block, we're going to take that to a 87. That does allow us to get anchor, chase down artist, and pogo. So you will be able to block some shots. So no need to worry about that. For the rebounding, I wanted this build to have rebound chaser on at least silver. So I took the defense rebound to an 83, and the offensive rebounding is a 50, okay? But I would like to try to get that post lockdown, but. Uh, we might not be able to get it. I'm trying to see where I can take something from, but it is what it is if we don't get it. You know what I'm saying? You're going to be on the perimeter with this build the majority of the time anyway. So we do get box out beast. We get pogo. We get rebound chase. Now for the speed, we're going to take that up to a 75. And as you can see, we get chase down artists on gold with that. We also get hyperdrive. Uh, we got a 67 on the acceleration. We got a 74 strength on the build. We have an 80 vertical. That 80 vertical is to get that chase down artist on gold. And we're going to put the red zone stamina. Now, I was going to try to get that um, post lockdown. But as you can see, we don't really have room for error, man. Like, if you want to take the perimeter defense down, you could do it like that if you want to. You can get it. You know what I'm saying? But do you want to do it? That's up to you. I'll leave it up to you guys. You know what I'm saying? But let's get into the shades up. Are you ready? Because guess what? I do not clickbait. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Now, we do have shades of. Air Harrington, Paolo Bancaro, and we have Kevin Durant, and the build name is the three-level threat. That's the build. I'm out of here, man. Charge!